What's up everyone? John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here. The iPhone 5 is coming and it's leaking faster than a baby's diaper, which is a gross analogy, but true. Stick around, let me tell you what you can expect. So what began a few months ago as the most boring parts reveal ever, we saw headphone jacks and camera modules of what's going to be the next iPhone. We're calling it iPhone 5. Chances are Apple's going to call it the new iPhone like they did with the iPad. But finally, we have something substantial. Uh, the folks at 9to5Mac broke out the big boys today with back casings from what's going to be the next generation iPhone, or presumably what's going to be the next generation iPhone. Uh, it is made of metal. Uh, so you've got two different colors, black or white. They're also saying we might have two additional colors, so kind of cool to see what that might be. Uh, you've got that two-tone look that we had with the very initial uh, iPhone, except now you've got plastic on the top and the bottom. Uh, definitely a different look than what we've seen in the past, but it does reveal a bigger screen size, presumably going to be four inches. Uh, the camera is still in the same spot, but what's moved is the headphone jack is now on the bottom, similar to where it is on the iPod Touch. We now have a smaller dock connector, so goodbye 30 pin, hello, I don't know, 10 pin, or whatever Apple decides to call it. Uh, saving space in that dock connector is gonna allow them to beef up the speaker. Uh, so the speakers look to be much larger uh, in the next generation iPhone. Uh, we don't know much about what the camera module is gonna be or what features might be in it. Uh, although this is all lining up very nicely for a presumed announcement at WWDC coming up in June 11th, which is now just a few short weeks away. Uh, the tech world widely assumed Apple is gonna wait until the August to October timeframe to unleash a new iPhone on the world. Uh, but seeing all these leaks this close to production kind of lends some credence to the rumors that WWDC might not be just about updates to the MacBook Pro and iMac line. It might be about the new iPhone as well, and hopefully iOS 6. So what do you guys think of these new designs, whether or not they're real or not real, yet to be seen? Take this all with a grain of salt. But I'd love to know what you guys think. Do you like the look? Do you not like the look? I'm happy that just looks different. Coming from the iPhone 4, the iPhone 4S, certainly the internals were beefed up, but the phone just looked the same. I'm happy to have something that's going to look a little bit different, going to have a little bit of a bigger screen, and hopefully iOS 6, please, will have some new features. I need widgets or information at a glance. Looking at square icons just isn't doing it for me. Anyway, guys, love to hear what you have to say. I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.